I'm having a first look at the uh, Crow Hill Voltspeeder Studio Drums, and it's very interesting. It's a mirrored layout, so you've got, and you've got another octave up. So not all sounds are exactly equal. For example, this crash over here, and the ride sounds different up here. So there's some good choices. The E flat snare, for example, on the lowest octave is that, and it's that here. So I'm just going to play some beats and not try to do anything in particular, just see how it feels under the fingers. So one thing, for example, is that this closed hi-hat on the C is not mirrored on the first octave, so you kind of have to do a bit of ergonomically stretchy contortionist stuff to play this. some nice choky cymbals um, tends to be on the uh, white keys and its corresponding free symbol is above or below so it's a good layout I like it overall um, it's just taking me a little while to get used to because it's different than a lot of things I play I'll do. 